Hey everyone, so I have, um, I guess some, I don't want to say cool gameplay, but I just have a cool match. I think it's a cool match because I finally, 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 finally get my, um, move. <laughs> like, I have been playing this game day one since it came out, and I've never gotten a nuke, and I've never really tried ever, um. But I finally ended up getting one the other day in this match, so I was just like so stoked. Like, oh my god, I can't believe I finally got one. Like, after all of this time, I, you know, got one. So, I'm really excited and really happy that I got it, and it was really fun to get it because I was playing with somebody super special to me, my baby Aaron, and um, he actually ended up getting a new before this match, and all I have to say is, Doom, you're a big fat hater because we got back-to-back -back nukes, so whatever to you, but he can't ruin our um, super awesome happy parade that we had that day, <laughs> but... Uh, and why I titled this The World's Slowest Nuke is because it's just that. This match was almost 10 minutes long, and I don't know. For those of you that don't have a sense of humor, I suggest you get one, because <laughs> the title of this is just a joke. It's like, for those of you that don't think Respect the Vag is funny. Vag, by the way, stands for vagina, and most girls have them. So, you know, I have one, so which is why I titled it that. If you guys don't like it, then don't watch my videos, I guess. <laughs> I had no idea that, or I shouldn't say I had no idea, I just didn't even think about it that Hutch had started, you know, titling some of his video videos, like, Respect the USPs or whatever. I just was, well, you know, thinking about it, and I was like, oh my gosh, that's such a funny title, like, Respect the Badge, and I'm a girl, and LOL. <laughs> but yeah, I wasn't trying to copy anybody, I just thought it was funny. But anyways, oh, and yeah, before you guys, like, jump all over me and sort of you know, flash mob or whatever against me because I'm using the noob tube on my FAL. Those are the only two kills I got with it and I didn't spam it like most people do online. I was trying to complete the dumb challenge for this gun and I actually stopped after a while after I got the red dot sight because I didn't need to do, use it anymore and that was like the only attachment I had unlocked for it. So I'm not rocking danger close. I was steady aim or not steady aim. I totally messed it up. And I was steady aim, but I have um, stopping power on there. I don't use Danger Close. I don't even have Danger Close Pro unlocked. So, yeah. <laughs> I'm just trying to get all of these out here before you guys can find something else to ding me on. Or not all of you, but, you know, there's always a few people that like to say something and nitpick the videos. But, anyways, um, part of the other thing that I wanted to talk about in this video is a really cool opportunity that I've got or been presented with. Um, I'm now a director, I guess that's what you want to say, with Machinima. I um, got sent an email asking if I wanted to join the director's program and I said yes and so I uh, signed the paperwork and um, you know got stuff back that I need to do and it's just a really exciting opportunity and I just want to say, you know, thank you to everybody that subscribed to my channel and then, you know, really watching my videos and kind of getting my name out there. I don't really want to say getting my name out there, but I, I guess you guys know what I mean. Um, I honestly couldn't have done it without you and it's, you know, even if zero videos get posted on there, I'm perfectly fine with that. Just being offered the opportunity to have my gameplays on there is really cool because I honestly don't think there's anything special about anything that I post. I just, this is how I play and I know a lot of you guys are going to say, oh, you're such a noob and you're terrible and you know what I know. I've never once ever said that I was any good at this game and why you guys want to watch my gameplay and listen to me, I don't know. <laughs> but I enjoy doing it and that's why I post it and there's some of you guys out there that like it so uh, that's why I continue to do it. Um, I understand and I know that things like this don't happen to everybody. Uh, you don't go from having 100 subscribers to like 11,000 subscribers in, you know, a couple of weeks. That just doesn't happen. Um, so I'm very thankful to Hutch and I'm very thankful to John for allowing me to do, do commentaries with them. Uh, it was a huge, you know, shock and I was so surprised when I, they asked me and so it kind of, it just started from there and I understand, like I said, it. This just doesn't happen to everybody, but 
I got extremely lucky, and I know that. I'll be the first to tell you how lucky I got. Um, I'm, and like I said, I'm so thankful to everybody. I really couldn't have done this without any of you guys. And thank you for subscribing. Thank you for giving me tips. Thanks for leaving comments and liking my videos or disliking them, you know. Um, I really, I do appreciate it. Um, I, I don't really know what else to say. I'm like, you know, I just never thought that something like this would ever happen to me. And why I'm sitting here is because I seriously thought somebody was going to round that corner there because my teammate got killed and I thought he was going to come back. Um, the opponent or whatever. And so that's why I was sitting there because I was trying to sound more my, with my headset. <laughs> but they never came to me like sat there. And I think they were probably waiting for me to come around. But I was trying to be patient. <laughs> so that's why I was sitting there. Um, but yeah, like I was saying, it's just... It's just a really cool opportunity and I'm really excited about it and part of me, I'm like excited and I'm also kind of like, oh my gosh, what did I set myself up for? Because, you know, getting your videos on Machinima is a huge audience there and the way I play is the way I play and I'm just like, oh my god, I'm getting crucified because people aren't going to, you know, people are going to be like, oh, you suck and I'm like, I know I suck, so <laughs> I don't know, but, you know, I'm not Flame Truth and I'm not Hutch and I'm not St. Anders and I'm not anybody else I just this is how I play and hopefully you know in time I'll get better but as of now I'm just a pretty average player so um, hopefully I'll get some you know okay matches that I can post that people won't be completely like horrified with. <laughs> and you know there's a huge possibility that my matches won't even get posted on there or they'll just you know they won't so you know I don't even know but like I said, it's just a really cool opportunity, and I haven't seen any other female directors on there, so I'm not sure if I'm, like, the first female director, but, I mean, if there is, you guys should let me know, because I haven't seen any. I've, and I watch a lot of those videos on Machinima, Respawn at least. There could be just on the regular Machinima channel that I don't know about, but, um, if there are, totally let me know, because... Right now I'm kind of thinking, hey, I think I might be the first female director, and if I'm not, I would like to be directed. Uh, but it's actually kind of cool to think about because I've never been, like, the first at anything, you know? Like, and not to, like, throw in my whole gender thing because, oh, hey, I'm cool, I'm a girl, look at me. I just haven't seen any, so if there have been, um, definitely let me know. But here's where I get my, I finally get my seven kill streak, and I'm like, somebody's coming around the corner. I'm like, oh my god, I hope I don't die, and oh my gosh. And so I get the guy coming around the corner, because he totally doesn't look at me, but I get a super awesome triple kill, and then a double kill, and so I was like, oh my gosh. <laughs> and I know, I was so excited, I should have waited to pull out my chopper gunner, and um, I should have waited until my harrier was done uh, shooting at people and killing them because I don't think my Harrier got that many kills and it probably could have gotten a lot more if I didn't um, pull out my chopper gunner. I was just really excited and I didn't even think about it until I started watching this video and I was like, oh crap, damn it, I should have waited. <laughs> I've also noticed with the chopper gunner, I get a lot of, um, what's it called, assists and I think it's because I'm not really used to using the chopper gunner and it like moves around all the time. I'm like, oh my gosh, I just wish it would stay still so I can like move it myself and yeah, I was like freaking out though. I was like, oh my god, oh my god, oh my god, what if I die? What if I die? I'm so close. I think I, well, at least I thought I was really close because I'm like, oh my god, I got my Harrier and I got my chopper gunner and I think I'm really close because I'm killing people and I don't know how many kills I have. I was like, I know I had 12 because of that Harrier and then 13 because of that guy I killed. I was like, I don't know how many kills I got with the chopper gunner. I'm like, what the, oh my gosh. And so I'm like super nervous coming out of here because I'm like, it would just be my luck. Trust me. It would be my luck that I would be so close to a nuke and I would die at the very end. Like, oh my gosh. <laughs> it's just, you know, just my luck. But obviously then I get, I pull it out. But getting the last kill, I'm like, oh my gosh, I just, I want my last kill, what do I do, what do I do, I don't want to get surprised and die, I'm like, oh my gosh, oh my gosh, and so, Aaron ends up downing somebody over here, well, puts him on the last stand, and I should have just thrown my grenade out there, but I killed him, I was like, oh my god, I finally got it, I'm <laughs> so excited, <laughs> I'm such a dork, I know, I know, I know, we're such dorks, but... He had gotten his nuke in the previous game, and so I get my nuke in this game. And I'm just like, oh my god, do I call it in now? Do I call it in now? Do I wait? Do I wait? I was like, what do I do? I know we're losing. Should we try to capture more points? I mean, I don't know. And so I was like, oh, fuck it. I'm just going to call it in. 
And I, the last match we played, he called his in like right away, and we totally could have like been close to finishing the game, or you know, close to win or what, or got more kills and stuff. But I was like, whatever, I'm just gonna <laughs> call it in. So I was so excited, and I finally got my nuke, and there you go, you guys, the world's slowest nuke, yay! <laughs> <laughs> um, but the final score was 40 and 4. Um, it's probably, I think, the best that I've done on a, a regular domination match. Um, so I was pretty proud of myself. But again, thank you so much for all of you guys' support. I'm like so grateful for it. And thank you so much for watching my videos and subscribing to me. And that's about it. So I'll talk to you guys later. All right, bye. <laughs> I'm a running <laughs> Thank you.